and Jaden Stapleton of the U.S. Virgin Islands. Four heats in this one, so the top athletes in each heat will advance by position, and then the next four best times will also make it to the final. Very little room for error. There is the favorite Marcinia Rose of Jamaica, 45-93. A week ago, Stapleton. eight days to the day now. Closest to your screen, uh, 594 Jaden Stapleton from the uh, U.S. Virgin Islands. Could find the going really tough in this race. Comes in with a 55-second flat seat time. And then, of course, he's out in lane eight, so he doesn't get to see much marks. of what's taking place. Tiger Peterkin of Grenada is expected to challenge for a spot in the final and uh, will want to produce a big effort here maybe go sub 48 for the first time in his career he'll have the push from this man set off they go oh recall that's interesting I think there may have been a little bit of an interruption from the high jump which was taking place at the same time um, an athlete uh, was attempting a height in the heptathlon high jump, and that may have put the athletes and or the starter off. We'll see which it was. You see the athlete up at the top of your screen there just going over, and that elicited a response from the crowd. Can't quite make out what may have transpired as far as the actual start was concerned. No indication yet from the officials as they have a bit of a dialogue. So the favorite Marcinia Rose of Jamaica in four, Tigan Peterkin. The Grenadian number two goes in lane five. From Haiti, Thanson Orville starts in lane number two. Grenada having a real nice build up to the Carifta Games with Carifta trials in early March, then the Intercol Championships, that's their high school championship. Very vibrant high school championship here in Grenada, sponsored by KFC. Love the event. Great videos right across YouTube. If you haven't checked that out yet, you need to go and check it out. It is quite a vibe. The Grenadian High School Championship, Intercol. On your mark. So we did get a warning issued to Sir Carey in lane 7 from Bermuda. But he remains in the blocks as they get set for heat 1. Of event 13, the boys 400 meter dash under 20. Set. Heat one of four. Marcinia Rose three, got up quickly. One. The Grenadian Peterkin also moved away well and closes down. And Nikolai Clark of Barbados in lane number six. Rose of Jamaica now easing down the back straight away with Peterkin of Grenada trying to keep pace. Nice run as well from Gardner of Antigua and Barbuda from lane number three. They go through 200 meters. Rose, he has an easy, silky, smooth style. He is really a delight to watch. Very good at 200 meters as well. 20.79 there. He takes them down the home stretch. Peter Kinn of Grenada on the outside. The crowd liking the challenge from the Grenadian. Only the winner is short of a spot in the final. And that means the Jamaican has to put in a sprint to make him his spot safe. 47-69. That was a stroll. But it's a very good start. It might be a personal best for the Grenadian. He may have gone on the 48 seconds for the first time. But it's the Jamaican who qualifies automatically for the final. A little bit of a wry smile from him. He thought he had qualifications sewed up a lot earlier than uh, turned out to be the case. 47.7 for his time in uh, this one. And we await the times uh, for... Uh, the, the, the Grenadian Sydney should have been 
under uh, 48. He was right on the heels of uh, the young man from Jamaica. Certainly in the latter stages of the race, if not at the end. See him there with a very fine challenge. Uh, he's uh, presenting uh, Peter Kin. But more than equal to the task, Marcino Rose he just uh, pulls away for the spot in uh, the final. 47.74 his time. And uh, Peter Kin, 47.92. Yeah, Gardner, 49.08. To finish in third position, 49.71 for Clark in fourth with 49.89 for Orville. We'll watch those times along with the 52.74 that I doubt very much will be enough to make it through to the final. The winner plus the next four best times. By the way, just a quick correction into Colin Grenada sponsored by Republic Bank. Apologies. I don't know why Kurt Felix